all credibility and dignity the moment you see their butt crack. What? Their butt crack. No, I mean, what does the presence of someone's butt crack mean to people losing dignity? Well, it immediately signifies that one lacks the ability to dress himself. You can never provide me any adequate reason as to why I should give my attention to such an individual. Perhaps one likes to sag their pants? Irrelevant. If you sag your pants, you're an idiot. Well, that's a bit ad hominic, if you will. I will not, as this is not a formal debate, and I'm attacking the subject at hand. If it had been ad hominem, I would have attacked you for being an idiot for attempting to justify that showing your butt crack in any context is acceptable. You've given this a lot of thought. I like to think. Not many people do. Well, this may just be my opinion, but I don't like to see other people's butt cracks either, but that's just because that's where Lepu comes from. Lepu, as you so elegantly described it, doesn't actually come from the butt crack. You see, it makes its existence. And our waiter picture. has arrived. Go with any me a females. Today, I will have a cup of the finest, clearest ice water. Okay. Oh, and I'll have just a if he's back in exactly one minute, I'll leave a $20 tip. Oh, come on. And what's with people always ordering just water? Such a critical aspect of our existence, and yet people trivialize it with minimalizing adverbs such as just. No one should ever be ashamed to ask for something that our body so desperately needs. So, back to this butt crack theory. If you could solidify your all your claims into one compact thesis statement, what would it be? It pays great dividends to never expose your butt crack to the general public. Sir, I'd like your finest spring water, please. And the check, please. Leave him about three minutes. You're far too generous. I'd say 15 minutes at least. In fact, tack another hour or two on there just for cushion. Wow. I hope he gets back here soon so we can get out of here. I'm about to have a Boston pee party up in here. Just go to the restroom. You think that these knuckle draggers actually clean that place? Well, yeah. Not enough for me. Now, back to our butt cracks discussion. What I'm about to do next is of utmost importance and is absolutely imperative that you do exactly as I say. I'm listening. You'll need to be watching as well. Tilt your head 45 degrees to your right. And now 45 degrees down. I don't see what this has to deal with butt crack. You'll see. It is imperative that you do not avert your eyes or tilt your head in any way, even when Joe comes back. Whatever you say, oh captain, my captain. Now listen, that guy Joe has been nothing short of an ass to us this entire time. What you're about to witness will render all of that completely irrelevant. I still don't see how this has to Just humor me. Why, hello, my dear waiter, Joe. Oh, no! Uh. How? I know. How? Calculations of your location and noticing that those pants have been slipping down this entire time. Incredible. So, now do you see what I was referring to in regards to butt cracks and credibility? I think... Yeah? You need to rethink the way you view things because I still have no idea what you're going on about. What the hell, man? I just saw this dude's ass. That's not the point. The point is, I just saw Joe's ass, and I'd like to get some money from so I can remember the finer things in life, you know, like grass growing or, you know, counting bumps off the ceiling. Zero sympathy. 